The morning of Saturday the 25th of November, launching the jet ski into the sunrise on the Waikato River. Yellowtail kingfish was the target today and I was armed with jigs, stick baits and also live baits if I could catch some. I wanted to catch a legal kingfish using each method, especially since I have yet to land a legal kingfish on a stick bait. After crossing the bar I stopped at the current line where the dirty river water meets the clean salt water. I cast around a small sabiki and caught a few kawai for live bait. Once I had a few fresh baits, I was off to the fishing grounds. I had company on the trip out in the form of a pod of dolphins. These truly are incredible creatures and it always amazes me how playful they are. Right, enough of the dolphins, now time for some fishing. I found lots of sign on the sounder and deployed a live bait. After a few drifts with no interest, I put the live bait in the rod holder and sent a jig down. I soon found out that my live bait was probably too big to be eaten by the fish that were below me. I kept on jigging and hoped that all the commotion would bring a larger fish in closer and in turn eat the live bait.
I soon found out that life baiting and jigging at the same time has its flaws. This fish resulted in a huge tangle in the braided lines which took me a good 10 minutes to untangle. And after all of that, I was finally able to land a legal sized kingfish to take home. With jigging ticked off the list and still nothing caught on the live bait, it was time to try stick baiting. You can see the splashes as the fish attack the stick bait, but unfortunately, still no fish big enough to get hooked. And after this, the kingfish bite went dead, so I went off to find some snapper before heading home. Another awesome day out on the water, although the large kingfish was not to be seen, there was always next to me.